All right, it's Joe Bruin here with All Access Entertainment, and we are here with the fourth installment, Volume 4, of the history of promo photos from the world of professional wrestling. So here we are, Volume 4. We're kicking it off with an authentic original WCW promo photo of good old JR, Jim Ross. This promo photo is from 1992. One of my favorite, if not my favorite, Jim Ross promo photos out there. All right, up next we have WCW promo photo. And as you can see, it says Perfect Sean, Sean Stasiak. So Perfect Sean, Sean Stasiak, this is from the year 2000. And there is no photographer listed um, as far as, uh, you know, we always like to list who took the photo. But it is from 2000. And it is the Perfect Sean, Sean Stasiak. And we also have the variant of this promo photo as well. And as you can see here, it is Sean Stasiak, but it doesn't say Perfect Sean. So you have two different versions of it, both from the year 2000. It's obviously the, the same shoot. And this one is signed authentically. And then in the back, we included the COA from WCW, directly from World Championship Wrestling, Certificate of Authenticity. Up next... We have the Harris brothers, Ron and Don Harris. They were the DOA in the WWE. This promo photo is from 2000. And this is also authentically autographed by both members. And once again, in the back, we put the COA slip direct from WCW World Championship Wrestling. Up next... We have Alan Funk, who also played Kiwi in WCW. This is authentically autographed from the year 2000. And this too has the WCW COA in the back. Up next, former WCW announcer Mark Madden. He was a ringside commentator, worked for their... Uh, their website as well. Um, I believe he did some radio for them. This is also from the year 2000 and it is autographed authentically. COA from WCW in the back. Pretty cool piece. You don't see the Mark Madden come up that often. Up next we have Jameson Winger. Jameson Winger is from, of course, WWF Prime Time Wrestling. He was also the co-host of the Bobby the Brain Heenan show in the 80s. Uh, this is an authentic original promo photo from 1991. And, and uh, photographer Tom Buchanan. Now, this was the only official promo photo of Jameson. Very cool piece. Got to work with him in person. Uh, became a friend over the years, and as you can see, it is autographed to the New England Pro Wrestling Hall of Fame. Thanks for caring. Love, Jameson. Very, uh, very nice guy. Up next. Very difficult promo photo to obtain. This is the Portuguese Man o' War, Aldo Montoya. It is from 1995. It is part of the P series. So this is P number 261. And photo credit going to Tom Buchanan. And this too was autographed. Aldo Montoya, Man o' War. Up next, a very difficult promo to find. Jacob and Eli Blue. The Blue Twins. The Blue Brothers. Uh, they were also the Harris Boys, which I just showed you from WCW. Um, of course, you know, they were in uh, TNA as well. Uh, this is part of the P-Series. P-Series P 
Promo number 273. Photographer Tom Buchanan. And it's from 1995. A lot of these new generation promos from the mid-90s are extremely difficult to find. They just didn't make a lot of them, so pretty cool pieces to have indeed. Here we have an 8x10 of Mr. Biggs, the late Michael James, a.k.a. Mr. Biggs. Uh, wrestled locally and all over the... New England scene for many, many years, and he signed it, Mr. Biggs, 2000, Bigger is Better, and it is uh, to Hardcore Joe. Here we have an extremely rare promo, uh, the only one that I know of its kind. It is from 1994. And it is a WWF official promo photo of Timothy Well, Stephen Dunn, the tag team of Well Dunn. Photographer Tom Buchanan. This is the only one that I know of that's in existence. So a super rare promo here. And as you can see, Stephen Dahl, Rex King. It is signed by both of them. They printed their names on the back and included their... Uh, cell phone numbers at the time, so they were probably, you know, passing this along to somebody to, uh, you know, get some information to. So, pretty cool, maybe for a booking or something. Here we have the ninth wonder of the world, China. This is a rare promo photo. WWF scratch logo, it's from 1998. Part of the P series, P number 474. And it looks like David McLean for photo credit. Photographer David McLean. This is a rare, hard to come by China promo for sure. So please let us know who some of your favorite superstars are, some of your favorite promo photos, what's in your collection. We'd love to hear from you. Here we have one of the more rare Lita promos out there from the year 2000. It is part of the P series. Promo number 609. Rich Frida is the photographer. Don't forget to like, comment, and of course share. And uh, of course subscribe to our page as well because we've got tons of content on the way. Here we have the very popular P series, P number 500. This is a pretty sought after promo photo. There are a lot of fakes out there, a lot of copies of this promo for some reason. But this is an authentic version of World Wrestling Federation Champion The Rock from 1998, P number 500. And the photographer is Rich Frida. Here we have WWF Terry Reynolds. This is authentically autographed. It's from the year 2000. Pretty sought after. Another one that's uh, for Terry Reynolds is pretty difficult to find. One of her more rarer shots. And it is part of the P series. And it's P number 595. Once again, photographer Rich Frieda. Here we have the Nature Boy, Ric Flair. This is another promo photo that's uh, pretty hard to come by. Goes for big money sometimes, whether it's signed or not. Uh, it is 1991, an official WWF promo photo. And as you can see, it says the real world's champion, Ric Flair. And there he is with the WCW championship. It is part of the P-Series P number 64. And photographer Steve Taylor. Another very hard-to-find promo photo from the convict himself, Nails, from 1992. This is a WWF promo photo. Steve Taylor, once again the photographer. It is part of the P-Series, P number 93.
Here we have an 8x10 of Big Rick Fuller, former WCW superstar, uh, wrestled with the power plant train there, um, obviously wrestled all over New England, worked for Killer Kowalski, worked for Tony Rumble, you name it, Big Rick Fuller, there you see it's personally autographed and signed to the show Joe Bruin. Here we have another 8x10 of Ox Baker, the legendary late great Ox Baker, signed personally to Joe, and he did sign it, Ox Baker. Very cool piece, became a, a good friend over the years, and ring announced him many times, and he's worked for me at my fan fests. Great guy. Next up we have The Event, Chuck Palumbo. WCW official promo photo from the year 2000. And it is authentically autographed. Flip it around. We do have the COA. Direct from WCW. Very cool piece. He wasn't known as the event for too long. So uh, pretty interesting piece. Up next we have Stevie Ray. One half of the Harlem Heat. It's a WCW official promo photo from 1999. It is authentically autographed. It's got the COA direct from WCW. Now, when you're collecting autographs, you know, it's it comes down to preference. Some people don't like it personalized because if you want to go turn around and resell it, uh, the value does go down if it's signed to a, a certain individual. Um, unless it's somebody who passes away because then, you know, it goes way up in price anyway. Um, but I usually try to get them just signed as is, as you can see. Um, I don't have many that are personalized to me, uh, for that specific reason. Up next, we have a very cool promo photo here. This is an official WWF promo photo. It's an arena photo. Um, very old, from the early 80s. And there it is, Mr. Bob Backlund himself. It is not autographed by Bob, but it is autographed by the official that night. And he signed it, The Ref, Dick Worley. Legendary referee, the late, great Dick Worley. So, very cool autograph to have. And it is, like I said, an authentic promo photo. And we hope to get this signed by Bob Backlund down the road. Here we have the Godwins. This is WWF Scratch logo, official World Wrestling Federation promo photo from 1996. It is authentically signed by both members, Vinnius I and Henry O, the Godwins. It is not signed by Hillbilly Jim. It is part of the P-Series, and it is promo number 330, photographer Tom Buchanan. Now, the interesting thing about that is there is a variant of this promo. As you can see, you have the Scratch logo there. We have the other version, which has the Box logo here in the corner. So we've got both the... Scratch logo and box logo. Pretty cool. Try to get the variants whenever there are a variant available. So, very cool to have. Here we have the creation of Devastation Atom Bomb. WWF official promo photo from 1994. It is part of the P-Series. P number 254. Photographer Tom Buchanan. Here we have Doink the Clown along with Dink the Clown. This is an official WWF promo photo. And it is P-Series 249. P number 249. Photographer Tom Buchanan. Surprisingly, no date here. Normally there is a date on the promo photos. A year, I should say. So that's interesting to see.
Here we have a great shot of Mr. Perfect. It's an official WWF 1996 promo photo. It is part of the P series, P number 348. Photographer Tom Buchanan. Here we have another great promo of World Wrestling Federation champion, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. An official WWF promo photo from 1996. It is part of the P-Series, P number 344. Photographer Tom Buchanan. Here we have a WWE promo photo of Crime Time, the late great Shad Gaspard, along with JTG. Crime Time, this is from 2006, an official WWE promo photo. It is part of the P-Series, P number 1143. John Guamundo is the photographer for this one, authentically autographed by both members. And I should mention that it does come with the Certificate of Authenticity on the back. Up next, we have the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels, Big Daddy Cool Diesel, the two dudes with attitudes. They are the World Wrestling Federation Tag Team Champions at this point. It's an official WWF promo photo from 1994. Part of the P-Series, P number 233, photographer Tom Buchanan. Next up, WWF official promo photo of Hillbilly Jim. Hillbilly Jim did some announcing with them and also uh, always in working with Coliseum Home Video and WWF Home Video. He was a big part of, uh, of those parts of the company. Uh, so this is part of that aspect of his career. Uh, it is from the year 2000 and it is part of the P-Series. It is promo number 623. And photographer Rich Frida. And of course, this Hillbilly Jim is authentically autographed as well. And does come with the COA on the back there. Here we have Brett the Hitman Hart. Now, this is a, a, a rare one. Uh, this is an official WCW glossy promo photo. Um, it's just a little out of the ordinary from your traditional promo photo as there is no year. So there's no year on there. Um, there's also no WCW logo at the top of the promo. But there you have it. Brett Hitman Hart, an official WCW promo photo. Uh, we have the photographer here. Mark Many is the photographer. Very cool shot of the Hitman. Up next, Classy, Freddie Blassie. This is a WWF 1995 promo photo. Tom Buchanan is the photographer. It is part of the P-Series. And it is P number 283. Up next, Big Daddy Cool Diesel. Diesel Power. It's an official WWF promo photo of 1994. It's part of the P-Series, promo number 234, photographer Tom Buchanan. Up next, a very difficult promo to find. This is Rex Lardner, an official WWF promo photo of Rex Lardner. He was one of the uh, employees behind the scenes with the World Wrestling Federation. This is from 1994. It is part of the P-Series, promo number 239. And we have photographer Tom Buchanan. Here we have Big Daddy Cool Diesel as the World Wrestling Federation Heavyweight Champion. It's an official WWF promo photo from 1994. And it is part of the P-Series, P number 248. Photographer Tom Buchanan.
Here we have an official WWF promo photo of Dude Love. It is authentically autographed, for sure, and it is from 1997. Rich Frida is the photographer, and it is part of the P-Series, P number 413. Here we have Fatu, when he was uh, starting a singles career, the Make a Difference gimmick. It's an official WWF promo photo from 1995. Tom Buchanan is the photographer, and this is P number 308. Here we have an official WWF promo photo of the Ultimate Warrior. This is from 1996. Jim Sully is the photographer. It is part of the P-Series, P number 341. Here we have an official WWF promo photo of King Mabel. And this is part of the P-Series, P number 301. It is from 1995. Tom Buchanan is the photographer. Thanks as always for joining us. We appreciate you taking the time out here for volume four of the history of pro wrestling promo photos. If you have any questions at all, please leave them in the comments. Don't like, don't forget to like, share, and of course subscribe to our page. Lots more videos to come.